Campfire songs. Kids songs. Most kids songs are campfire songs. Here's one that I also used to play all the time with my kids when they were little and still want to get to go visit the classroom at my local elementary school. We break out a song by Rafi, who was a great children's entertainer and put together some great tunes and put on some great shows for kids. Very cool guy. So uh, one of his most popular songs is called Baby Beluga, a little song about a whale. And you just strum the chords. It does have, it's pretty much a one, four, five thing. I do it in the key of D. He probably does too. Don't know. Um, and uh, you can use the three main chords in D. D, G, and A. Any of the A's could be A7s. And there's a secondary dominant in there, E7. So again, a very easy strumming, strumming song with just four chords. A little bit of swing to it. parts of the song. Here we go. Baby beluga in the deep blue sea, swim so wild and you swim so free, heaven above and the sea below, and a little white whale on the go in the chorus. Baby beluga, baby beluga, is the water warm, is your mama home with you? so happy way down yonder where the dolphins play where you dive and splash all day waves roll in and the waves roll out see the water squirt now to your spout baby beluga baby beluga sing your little song Sing for all your friends, we like to hear you. When it's dark, you're home and fed. Curl up snug in your water bed. Moon is shining and the stars are out. Good night, little whale, good night. Baby beluga, oh baby beluga. With tomorrow's sun. Another day's begun, you'll soon be waking. Baby beluga in the deep blue sea. Swim so wild and you swim so free. Heaven above and the sea below. And a little white whale on the go. You're just a little white whale on the go. So I don't know that we even need much explanation for that one. There you go, there's the melody, there's the chords. Strum and sing along with me on that one. And you just need Ds, Gs, A7s, and E7s. And I like to play the E7 in this song with just two fingers. First finger on the G sharp on the third string, second finger on the B string, on the B, the note B on the A string, second fret of the fifth string. And then the A7, again, my favorite fingering for A7 is second and third fingers. Try to, if you're not used to using that, get used to it. Trust me, it's the best one. So. Uh, anyhow, I think that's all you need for Baby Beluga. You kind of got the tune, you kind of got the chords. Now all you got to do is find some kids that want to sing it with you.